Dear students, I welcome you in the course of Leadership, Emotional Intelligence and CN Making. This is module number 97 and we are going to talk about leadership that gets results. This article is written by Dan Goldman and the Dan Goldman is the person who is always coming up with an idea of emotional intelligence. And he says, that emotional intelligence ke a leader incomplete hai. Or emotional intelligence see, usko basis provide karti hai to achieve the higher performance and higher outcome. So when we talk about the leadership concerns that are there to get the results, there are certain aspects which Dan Goldman has identified. First of all, the leader should be able to come up with self-awareness because jab tak wo khud apne baare mein nahi jaan sakega tab tak uske liye difficult hoga ke wo dusron ko unki raah ka taayun sahi taur par karwa sake so self awareness is the foremost important thing jo ke ek leader ko zaruri taur par chahiye when he or she is there to develop his or her emotional intelligence the second thing is self regulation that the person is able to control his or her fears the person is able to control his or her concerns because jab tak wo apne aap ko khud control nahi kar sakta hai us waqt tak wo challenges ka samna bhi nahi kar payega the third thing needed by the leader to develop his or her emotional intelligence is basically motivation because a motivated person would be the person who can motivate others as well the fourth important thing is empathy ke wo dusron ke bare mein jaan sake the person is able to put his self in others shoe as well taaki wo ye jaan sake ke wo kya feel karte hain unko kis care ki zarurat hai unki kya zaruriyat hain so empathy ke baghair ek leader incomplete hai aur empathy hi basic source hai jisse ke hum ek aisa environment create kar sake ke jisme trust aur jisme credibility wo behtar se behtar ho paaye the fifth ingredient to become an effective leader is basically related to the social skill jisme ke hum ek rapport build kar pate hain apne logon ke sath hum unko is baat ka yakeen dila sakte hain ke wo bhi hum jaise hi hain aur hum sab milkar ek manzil ke taraf karamad aur development wo kar payenge therefore social skill is very important aspect when we talk about developing in terms of emotional intelligence ab emotional intelligence ke case mein when we focus upon self awareness to yaad rakhiyega ke self awareness mein sabse important cheez ye hai ke emotional self awareness aapki ho emotional self awareness jisme ke aap apne emotions and moods ko wo track kar sake understand kar sake prioritize kar sake the second thing is in the self awareness ke aap apne aap ko sahi taur par evaluate wo kar sako na aap exaggerate karo aur na aap apne aap ko underestimate karo because exaggeration or underestimation ye dono cheeze aapko accurate self awareness se wo dur le jayengi the third thing is in self awareness and that is self confidence because aap tab tak self confidence feel nahi kar sakte jab tak aapko apni sense of self worth ka pata na ho jab tak aap apne aap ko self esteem ke sath feel wo na kar sako tab tak aapka self confidence would always be shaken so to become a leader these are the most important things in terms of self awareness secondly in the development of emotional intelligence when we talk in terms of self management and self control remember that we need to have the perspectives jisme ke hum apne aap ki limits wo define kar sake we need to have the trustworthiness we need to have the conscientiousness we need to have the adaptability flexibility taaki hum har tarah ke mahol mein apne aap ko adjust kar sake we need to have achievement orientation taaki hum apne aap ko paaye manzil tak bhi wo pahuncha sake and we need to have the initiative capability ye tamam wo cheeze hain jinke sath aapki self management wo zyada behtar taur achieve ki ja sakti hai emotional intelligence mein the next phenomena we need to focus upon is social awareness aur us social awareness mein we need to have empathy we need to have organizational awareness and we need to have obviously which is the service orientation because us service orientation ke baghair hamara context in the organizational facility would be incomplete so emotional intelligence ke andar social awareness jab hum create karenge to we need to know ke service orientation hum kaise apni develop kare hum kis tarah se dusron ko madad provide kare unko mentor aur guide kaise kare ye tamam tar wo cheeze hain jinke baghair emotional intelligence would remain incomplete 
लाइक वाइज जब हम सोशल स्किल की बात करते हैं तो द सोशल स्किल इज ऑल्सो नीडेड टू बिकम विजनरी लीडर द सोशल स्किल इज ऑल्सो नीडेड वेन वी आर देयर टू डिवेलप अदर्स द सोशल स्किल इज ऑलवेज देयर वेन वी हैव टू कम्युनिकेट विद अदर पीपल इन इफेक्टिव एंड एफिशियंट वे एंड वी ऑल्सो नीड टू नो कि कम्युनिकेशन के लिए हमें किन किन चीजों का सहारा वो लेना है कौन सा मीडियम यूज करना है कौन सी लैंग्वेज यूज करनी है जो कि दूसरे बेहतर तौर अंडरस्टैंड वो कर सकें लाइक वाइज वी नीड टू हैव लाइक इन अवर सेल्फ द प्रस्पेक्टिव ऑफ चेंज कैटलिस्ट एक ऐसा शख्स जो कि एक चेंज को इनिशिएट भी कर सके और चेंज को इंस्टीट्यूशनलाइज भी कर सके एंड ऑब्वियसली वी हैव टू बिल्ड द स्ट्रॉन्ग बॉन्ड्स जिन बॉन्ड्स को बिल्ड किए बगैर हम शायद अपनी मंजिल को ना जान पाएंगे और जिन बॉन्ड्स को बिल्ड किए बगैर ना हम अपने फॉलोअर्स को सही तौर पर गाइड और ट्रेन वो कर सकेंगे सो इमोशनल इंटेलिजेंस के लिए इन तमाम तर इंग्रेडिएंट्स की वो जरूरत है डियर स्टूडेंट्स अगर हम इस सारी बात को कंक्लूड करें तो याद रखिएगा कि एक ऑर्गेनाइजेशन के अंदर एक लीडर इनकम्प्लीट होगा जब तक कि उसके पास सेल्फ अवेयरनेस सेल्फ कंट्रोल मोटिवेशन सेल्फ रेगुलेशन सोशल स्किल एम्पथी जैसे फैक्टर्स वो ना हो देर फोर हमें इमोशनली इंटेलिजेंट होना है एक ऑर्गेनाइजेशन के लिए बेहतर तौर पर काम करने के लिए थैंक यू